evening all and welcome back to Factorio. I am joined as ever by an audio gamer. Hello Log. Hello, hello. And you are putting in I thought it said Christmas, but it says Christopher. Uh <laughs> more train stations. Yes. Well I, I yeah. Yeah, I'm putting in the um the uh what are they called? The belts for all these train stations. Uh... Ah, yes, because they were facing the wrong way or something, weren't they? Yeah, they were. Ah. Very yes. annoying. Oh, dear, oh, dear. Okay, and I was working on this chemical plant thing here, the, the chemical plant zone for your good old friendly neighbourhood, Dr. Robotnik. Yeah. And, uh... Oh, crap. Mm. This actually needs to... Come up here, doesn't it? Do that. Uh, so I want to put in this here. That. And this wants to be. Uh, What does this one do? This wants to be breaking down a heavy to light ore, doesn't it? If I remember correctly. Yeah, heavy to light ore. Good. Okay. Uh, I'm just trying to remember what exactly it was I was doing. Uh, and that wants to go onto, I think, this belt. Yeah, that's the heavy belt. No, so it wants to go onto the light belt. So it wants to go onto that one there. But we need a pump here. So we're going to have to do that. Do that and put in a pump. There. Awesome. Uh, pull this out. And the, the idea of this is that hopefully, providing I get it correct, is going to be expandable. Whoops. Expandable sounds good. Yeah. So, I can't put that there. I can't put it there. Because one thing I always do get wrong with these is I underestimate just how many you need. You need a lot. Yes, yes, you certainly do. Uh, oh. there, there. Right, and unfortunately, I think that center one needs there. to be. Uh, there. Gonna need more splitters, aren't I? Darn it. Uh, oh. That breaks down the light auto petroleum. Okay. Oh no. That connects to that one. That. And it's getting heavy oil from there. And this one is getting light oil from here. Oh, wrong. Gonna need three more splitters. Darn it! And can I make them? Just three now. Yeah. But I don't have the materials to make them. Ah. That's not very helpful, is it? No. This is way more cramped than I think I I uh, had originally planned. So, if you come this way, there is no way in hell you're going to be able to get through. It's a non-pedestrian zone. Walk around. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you, you can kind of get up in between them, but you can't go left and right because there's just no space because the way the way it works. So, 
Yeah. That's fine though. That's that doesn't doesn't matter. It's another one of those once it's done. Done. Well shouldn't have to work. Okay. Then you're producing petroleum. You should have a pump here. Alright. That's in. Oops. Know how far that one needs to go, so I'm just there. All right, that's that one in. And then I need to get a, go get some stuff for some splitters. Uh, then we need to rename all the train stations. And then it's actually good to go. And then we can start setting up the next outposts, which is cool. Well, we need to go kill some biters first, actually. Uh, ah, yes. Yes, you did mention that. Uh, a little while ago, and I had forgotten. Some iron plates, definitely need some uh, of these so bad boys. There to leave it nice and compact. He's going to be making lubricant from heavy oil. That's not how you copy stuff, you hold shift. You don't just right click. There we go. <laughs> just right clicking tends to pick stuff up. Yes, yes, indeed it do. Uh, that train tree is going to be annoying, isn't it? Okay, so you're going to get light all. You do actually reach. You don't reach that's can I, can I bring them over by one we'll bring them over by one there we go so all the power cables fit and that's the reaches the pump there that's the reaches the pump there awesome right and then what I need to do is I need to put in some tanks down here and uh, right, so lubricants going over there that's light all that's petroleum that's light ore. So I'll put them. Alright, yeah. oh, that is hooked up. Very nice. Lucy Caption. That, like that, like that. And you're going to go that way. Awesome. So you're going to run that port in there. So, right. Very nice indeed. Alright. Oh, damn it. You are going to go to there. Uh, you are going to go right. there, and I have com that's a complete fluke. I did not mean to line them up so that they connect to them pipes perfectly well, but I am happy with that. That works wonders. Okay, and then we just run a wire. Uh, we'll run some green wire. There's all this. Bump. Between that one and that one and that one and that one and that one. Oh, no. There we go. And then uh, this one should hmm. be enabled if. Heavy oil is greater 
Delilo. Hook that up later. All right. Um, this would be if uh, Lytle is greater than Patrol. I think I'm going to come down and see what you're doing. Is there a car around here? There isn't a car. There are loads of trains around if you just want to, you know, yeah. borrow one to do your bidding for a while. I actually have a car on me. I just need some fuel for it. Plenty of trees around. That is true. That is true. If we take a deconstruction planner and then say, hey, ah, yeah, why don't you this deconstruct that? Okay. Thank you. That's enough wood for that. Uh, Whoa, that's a lot of trees. Menace. No, they're not. They're lovely and they help us breathe. And they destroy our cars. Well, I I I, I don't agree with that. I, I feel as if you may have run into a tree. No, 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 it stepped right out in front of me. Oh of course. Okay. This looks very complex. It's actually not. <clears throat> it's technically very simple. You have a line of refineries here. Mm -hmm. um, and to expand it, you just add more refineries on the end. Mm -hmm. And uh, all the pipes should just connect every okay. way they need to connect. And it should be, it should all work absolutely perfectly fine and happy and life is grand. Mm -hmm. uh, and then Basically, all the pipes come down to three rows of pipes here where I'm stood, but you can't see them because they're underground. You've got the heavy one here, you've got the light one in the middle here, and you've got petroleum above. Mm -hmm. And there's water at the bottom as well. Uh, yeah. And the heavy oil goes up to these chemical plants to get broken down to light oil, mm -hmm. and comes back down to the light oil run. And then the light oil gets pushed up into these ones to become petroleum, and it gets pushed down to the petroleum one. Okay. And the idea is that we fill up these three tanks here with heavy, medium, and light oil. Yep. And then the pumps go, well, hey, if heavy oil is greater than light oil, then turn on. So start pumping. So these chemical plants come on. And if, mm -hmm. uh, if light oil is greater than petroleum, then turn these ones on. So they start pumping, and they go. Okay. So it should always work. And then the lubricant line actually is connected to... It's not connected to the other side of this tank. It's connected to the main line. So it will always get fuel from the refineries. Okay. Very cool. Yes. Providing it works wonderfully. Um, I have no reason to doubt it shouldn't work. Uh, uh, but my, my brain's telling me that it's a yes. It's a yes from me. Of course it'll um, work. When, when are things that I built ever gone wrong? Exactly. They never do. All I need to do is I need to add... Well, I don't even need to add that to Because I'm going to run this straight down to the lubricant train, which is over there. Uh, but you're, you're, oh, you have tanks down there at the trains. Yeah. So I'm going to build the whole thing and then plug in the oil and... Mm -hmm. uh, Hopefully not watch it explode. Hmm. That'd be a good thing. That'd be a very good thing if it doesn't explode. Uh, that tends to be the case, unless it's a tree. Uh, 
No, I'm I'm not really one for exploding trees either. Hmm. Particularly if you're in the middle of chopping one down, it suddenly explodes. So that's not. Yeah, exactly... that, that's maybe kind of unfor unfortunate if that happens. Yeah. So that's this is heavy on. I just connected it to the wrong place, haven't I? This should be light. Oh, that's the wrong connection. Stupid Why trees. would you let me do that? Oh, hey, come back, robot. Come here. You. Is that not? I've had enough. <clears throat> I've had enough. You'll keep killing the trays. Don't like it. <laughs> yeah, <clears throat> that might be it. All right, I am going to go try and take out this spider base. Uh, oh, yes. Um, I I will come with you in a moment if you like. Uh, All right, that sounds good. Because it is uh, actually a quite large one. Let me just, uh, I want to connect up all the tanks so that I can turn it on and walk away and ignore it and pretend like it's real. All right. But I need more, uh, more pipes, more pipes, all the pipe. Should have really just run them as normal pipes rather than... I think I might do that. I might run them with normal pipes rather than the underground. -y. All right. Uh, yeah, well, here we have the pirates. Oh, I don't have a lot of ammo. I have 200 and no turrets and no spare ammo. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go pick up some ammo. So I don't have enough. Go forward. Oops. But what do you mean, oops? Hit a tree. Oh. How oops. have I got one air pipe? What? Oh, how has that happened? I've put down a single pipe somewhere. <laughs> single, single underground pipe. It's the same as my underground belts. I've got an odd number of fast underground belts, the red belts. Yeah. So there's one underground belt somewhere that either you've got or or is uh, somewhere, but I don't know where I'll put that one down now. Mm. So hopefully that's not going to break the whole line. We'll see. Okay, so the only real way to test this is uh, plug it in. to plug it in. And uh, that's a wall. Don't want a wall. You don't plug that in. And let's see what happens. Yeah. I see lubricant filling up on the train stand down there. I see petroleum filling up down there. I might need to put a pump in there for the uh, lubricant. It's filling up. The lubricant's filling up. The train's filling up. We have... Go. I do want to know why the oil train is not moving now. Very cool. It's just taking a really long time to fill up. I think it is. I think the oil train is just taking forever to fill up. Yeah. It, okay. It's probably not the fastest with the few. It's, yeah, it's only got four Derricks down there, so. Yeah. Right. Very nice. It is, running. it is running. It does appear to be working. So we have a train of lubricant, a train of petroleum, and a train of light oil. The light oil is going to be for flamethrower fluid because we discovered that flamethrowers work at 110% when you use light oil yep. compared to just normal oil. So. Oh. 
how are we going to uh, fuel our trains? Are we going to use coal? Or are we going to going to use solid fuel or rocket fuel? Or right now I've been using coal. Mm -hmm. Um. So. Yeah, I've just got a train with coal going around for it, but it is just called the fuel train, so we could change it to someone else if we want to. Yeah. Now, where are we? Are we making? Are we making turrets anywhere? Where are we making? Yes, we are. And and I don't know why I have no turrets on me. I swear, like I should have. But where where are turrets being made? Am I bloom? Uh. They are being made right beneath the ammo. Beneath the ammo? Yeah, or south of the ammo. Aha! I was staring at them when I walked away. Let's grab 50 turrets. Do, 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 do. Oh, I say if if you want to start running over trees and stuff, we need to build a tank. Yeah, that's true. They are very tree, and, and then even I enjoy running over trees with tanks. <laughs> yeah. I need to put my ammo down here, don't I? Oh. I feel as if the gun in the car <coughs> is way more effective than my hangar. It is. It is. And also, <coughs> the car itself has that armor. And my repair bots repair it as I'm driving it. Yeah. So I'm going to stay in the car. <laughs> <laughs> I feel much safer in the car. And if things go wrong, I can just, like, drive away. <clears throat> Don't stand in the goop. I thought I had shields oh, at I'm some dead. point. I'm dead. Oh, crap. I'm dead. I am I almost was dead. Trying to in them. I ran into a tree and the car got stuck. <laughs> Told you trees are menaces. Make it a desert map, no trees at all. That would be a problem for power poles. <laughs> <laughs> okay, the odd tree around water. Yeah. Wasted. Yeah. That would actually be kind of cool, I think. Another thing I think they're missing is uh, uh, other trains with uh, weapons on them. Yeah, so so it's not just the the artillery one. Yeah. yeah. So you have. Yeah, so you have like a close range defense for the train. Yeah, a, mach a machine gun train, yeah. flamethrower train, 
I agree. Not done. Don't stand in the goop. Why is my inventory full? Because you don't have your armor on. And the armor, for some bizarre reason, is the last thing you ever pick up. Yeah. Ah, no, it's because I, I have loads of trees in my inventory. Uh huh. Repair packs, I think. I've got a few on me. Yeah, I'm, I made some. I'm actually making some more because I'm running low. I can't, don't suppose I can make another car, can I? Uh... Steal mine. Oh, we've got rocket launcher. Thankfully, turrets don't get injured from the goop on the floor. No. That is a good thing. So, even though the car has armor and it's fantastic, it, you, if it was open world, it'd be great, but because it's not, Yeah. Hey, stop shooting my turret. Stupid worm. Wait, was that all of them? That was all of them. Nice. Should we check out a bit further, maybe? It's ice north of us. And there's one south of us as well. Okay, okay. Well, uh, which way do you want to go? All right, I'll, I'll go north, north with you. Okay, I'm going north first, and then. I don't have 51 turrets, so I picked up one of yours. Well, that's okay. Whoa! Oh. Turrets! I have got them set up on my action bar, just as Pete suggested, so thank you for that suggestion. Number one and two. One is turrets, two is uh, ammo. <laughs> mm. Yeah, I am almost dead. I need to give did it a minute. Fish? Sorry? Did you get any fish? Oh, yeah, I did. How do you eat them? I, I didn't. <laughs> I assume you put them on the action bar and just push the button. I, I don't know. Well, it could be. I don't know. No. Select them and drop them on your character. As in, click on your character when you got them selected. Oh, I don't. Oh, I don't know. I, I, I don't, don't know. know how to. I have no idea. Oh yeah, I ate some. All right. Yeah, you're right. Do you pick them up and drop them on the character. Yeah. Yeah. All 
Run back, run back. That thing. I need to just take a second. Heal up. Well, I suppose I could just eat my fish. The only reason I have fish is because I was uh, filling in uh, the water. <laughs> Ah, they're all dead. Yep. All right, I think we should take down, out the one down south as well. Yes, yes, I agree. All the bites we can see because that's yeah. what they have. Yep. Because the bites are not nice to the trees. Or to us. Well, we're secondary. You know, the trees are the most important thing. All right. Disagree. Anyone who hurts trees, especially with explosives, gets run over by train. <laughs> is that so? Yes, indeed. Yes, it is. Whoa! Don't kill me! Don't kill me! Oh god! I pushed the wrong button, then brought on my inventory rather than putting down turrets. <laughs> <laughs> That base? I see, that biter was attacking the trees. The biter was attacking the trees? Yeah, he actually attacked a tree. That was weird. <laughs> I think they do it if they get stuck. Yeah, he was running around in circles for a bit. Let's have a quick look here. Oh, look, this is the other side of the, uh, the lake that I walked all the way around in, like, the first or second episode. Yeah. All right. Okay, it seems clear here. Yeah. I think we're safe for now. Look here. Uh, yeah. But uh, we are out of time. We are. We are indeed. Yep. So uh, we shall finish off our little scouting for biters and uh, then probably go back to the base and rejoice. Yeah. That sounds like a plan. Oh, I, I don't have Smoke. any grenades. Jesus, there's a lot of trees here. Yay, trees. Tree exploding heaven. Uh, so, yeah, so I think we'll leave it here and come back next time, right? Yeah, <laughs> let's do that. Okay, so thank you all very much for watching. We hope you enjoyed this one, and we hope to see you again in the next one. Until then, as always, have fun. Bye-bye. <laughs>